I got caught. Oh no. <laughs> Not important. I only went to pick up my, my tablet and said hello. And and I accidentally read baby croissant. I was a little bit concerned there for a second. <laughs> yeah. Do you guys have a heat wave too? It's disgusting. <laughs> hello Ritata. Lady baby. I'm a dwarf. <laughs> Not that young. That's true. That's true. What canvas size do I choose? Why is this canvas size fucking big? What was the last thing I drew? I don't even remember. Gee. Uh. Wait. Wait. I. I'm growing a beard, maybe. Female beard. No, no, not background drawing. I, I wanna, <laughs> I wanna do the the good old drawing something for other people again. I gonna draw draw chibi heads, <laughs> cause it's so hot. I can't really focus on like coming up with like proper stuff. I was outside a bit for today, and man, my brain just kind of melted away. <laughs> It's too warm. Not even Maple did want to move anymore. Like legit, she did not. I hope you guys are doing okay, whoever the fuck you are. <laughs> uh, what size is this? I think you can't size. I swear I haven't held a pen in my hand for so long, uh, except for writing stuff, but not for drawing. Uh -huh. <laughs> Last thing you've drawn on the channel, I think, was ah, yeah, it might be. I think so, yeah. It was some Pokemon thingy, I believe. I have so many unfinished pictures on here, actually. <laughs> Maybe I will find time to finish them eventually. <laughs> it's kind of a pity, man. Shame. All those unfinished pictures, like this one. I think it could look nice if I managed to do what I had in my head with it. It was supposed to be underwater. I'm also sorry if my English is kind of butchered because I haven't spoken English in a while. <laughs> Anyways, did you guys see the new Pokemon trailer? Fucking Paella region. <laughs> That's what it sounds like to me. The Paella region. Can I have some shrimp in there? It was my first thought when I hear it. You gonna eat some shrimpies now? Shrimps? Oh god, I don't know how to draw anymore. Not to mention I lifted my laptop up so that it doesn't burn itself and it's really hard to reach the keys right now. <laughs> oh my god, how do I draw? How, do, how does a human properly function? I don't remember. Also, I'm sorry that the camera doesn't pick up my mouth so well. That's because... I'm rather low and that the camera is really high up right now. <laughs> because of the laptop standing up. Paldea. Yeah, Paldea. The first time they said I was like, did they just say Paella? Did they just name the region of the food? <laughs> did they really? I was like, oh, okay, I just mis misheard it, but still. Uh, okay. The bikes. The bikes look weird. Chess, did you like the legendaries of the new game? I know my brother likes them. I I have a distaste for them because of them of their function in the game. <laughs> Why? Then 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 see. I haven't seen anything. You didn't? Really? I, 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 I thought I talked to you about it as well. So I have to be worried. Well, the legendaries look like motor cycles and well their function in the game is actually to serve as your bike and your glider and whatever the fuck else climbing thingy <laughs> you ride them are they even trying I wonder what they have in store with the story because like you know every Pokemon game kind of 
so why does my model look so pissed all over? <laughs> Do I look that tired, man? Come on, camera. Like in in in, in the main main games, usually the story is kind of always the same with like some bad organization who wants to fuck up everything with the legendary, and now the legendaries are literally your goddamn mount. So I wonder what they have in store with the legendaries. Pokemon are transformers now. <laughs> no, I really do wonder what they have in store for them, really. Academia Narancha. <laughs> Grape. Yeah. It's also said that the appearance won't be as customizable as in the old games. I really like that aspect in games when you can really customize your character because it feels more like your character, you know. It's sad that they kind of remove that now. But I think it's also interesting that they for once decided that your 10 year old main character is actually a goddamn student. Like, usually they just yeet you out in the wild and now they're like, oh yes, you're going to that. Like, that school and then kick you out in the wild on a goddamn fucking motorcycle. Yes, go let the 10 year olds drive their motorcycle. My first thought when I saw the trailer was can I run over the Pokemon? <laughs> and my little sister lost it at the, at the new Wooper. She's so sad that he's brown. He's not a whooper, he's a pooper. See that meme all over now. <laughs> I'm happy not to be a Pokemon fan. <laughs> I mean... <laughs> I don't know if I'm like a Pokemon fan fan. I mean, I grew up with it, but like... I stopped really following the line after X and Y. Like, X and Y was the last game I actually seriously played, I believe. I remember I played Sun and Moon, but I don't even know if I really finished it. To be honest. Uh, I know that I played it and I know that the last thing I did in Sun and Moon was to try and catch a perfect IV Mimikyu. But that's the last thing I remember. <laughs> The whooper even has bones sticking out of his head. I think the design is actually kind of... If you if you look at it, you can see what they were thinking about. It's a poison ground type and they literally just made his head look like the, the poison skull you always see on like warning signs and shit. I don't think I ever played red. I might have, but I don't really remember. I wasn't really allowed to touch my siblings' um, games <laughs> when I was younger. I wasn't I, actually funny enough. I, I, my, my, my parents are really against me getting a console for a really long time. I don't remember how. My, I think, I think some of my siblings were begging that I would get a DS, and that was literally the only console I ever got. And I played like on my siblings' Game Boy when I was allowed to from their side uh, but I wasn't supposed to play games somehow I don't know man my parents were really strictly against it I remember at some point they took my DS away for an entire year because my father forgot where he was hiding it <laughs> yeah punishment Tried a couple more, but I get bored after evolving magic up and beating a couple of gyms. Yeah, I'm not of bread. I played the most of uranium. Okay, I don't know that one. Nah, but I can understand getting bored of like certain games. They always follow the same concept after all. Oopsie. I can't totally understand that. I mean, personally, I just I don't know. There's some nostalgic shit for me when it comes to Pokemon and Zelda. Like, I used to play Mario games as well, but personally I like them less than the other franchise, actually. Uh, because to me, Mario is like, really one... Is, 
I don't know, man. It has like this 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 linear level system where you just go from one map to another and you have those jump and run levels and I just it's not my kind of thing I feel like. <laughs> it's just not my kind of thing, I don't know. know people who really enjoy it but I feel like uh, I, I don't really somehow I miss the story in a lot of Mario games like some have more story than others but like the ones that I remember were like always yeah you just go go to the next one and you kill an enemy and, and, and a boss and then you go to the next one and until you finish the game in Zelda, at least, even if the story is really similar, you always have like different stories, and they are all connected in like different timeline thingies, even though they fucked the timeline up pretty badly and all that. <laughs> but you know, I don't know. Eh. Okay. Also, I'm really excited for the um, new Breath of the Wild, honestly. I wonder what they're gonna do with it. I hope they, they introduce a lot of new stuff in it. After all, they're taking so long. The prince is another castle. <laughs> I remember the the, 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 the the very old one where you had to jump over the barrels because Donkey Kong was throwing them at you. I remember we had that on a Game Boy. And I, I remember it being really bad at it. Because I didn't understand it back then. <laughs> was too young to understand when I played it. I played it maybe once and I don't remember. I, re I remember I was crazy for Tetris when I was a child. I don't know why. Tetris was like my fucking game. <laughs> I have a slight Tetris addiction. Whenever I start Tetris games, I have one on my phone. I won't be able to fucking stop anymore. Something so satisfying about Tetris. <laughs> my game Mario is still my Princess Peach statue. What? <laughs> the last Mario game I really remember playing is 64, I think was the name of it. The one where you can eat the penguins off the cliff. Mm -hmm, I remember doing that. <laughs> I had the urge to clean the map up, so I just yeeted the penguins down there. And I remember one specific water level in that game. It was a fucking eel in the water. I hated that eel, it always attacked me. And there were mushrooms, I think. I don't remember for sure though, it's <laughs> so long ago. And I remember I never understood the castle, like I never understood how to go, how to, go to Bo Bowser's place. I was always so confused. <laughs> mm -hmm. And I remember Super Mario Sunshine, but I did not really play it because that game is... I always got lost. Because you have to go to the same level like 20 times in a row and I never understood it. Because usually in Mario, that's not how it works. Usually you, you enter a new area and, and the old areas get irrelevant. In, in sunshine you're kind of like forced to go back to the same locations all the time because new areas open up in those locations and I never understood how to play that game because of it. So I only watched my siblings play it back then. I was too confused by that game, man. <laughs> the first game. Mario steals your peach statue. Wow. Can't find the princess so he steals the statue. <laughs> I remember in wait was it in was it in 64 I know I know there was multiplayer in there but I don't remember if you I don't remember what you played in that multiplayer I also remember that in in, in 64 there were like mini games there was one specific one where you um why is this turning black when I do this ah because I'm clicking I need to tab out and it works the game war games I don't even know that one. <laughs> I remember that in 64 there was some game where you had to sort pink and black bombs out. I was also kind of addicted to that as a child. It was fun to do.
chest, do you think it's soon time for another Nuzlocke? I'm thinking about doing the ghost one eventually. But I also would love to, 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 to do stuff with my friends. Honestly. <laughs> I, I bought a few games from the summer sale on Steam. They also got to play. And I also want to play Minish Cap so bad. <laughs> it's been a while since the last Nuzlocke. Yeah, it sure has been. The last one was the one I did with you. I still need to edit the video. <laughs> I did a little bit of editing, but I didn't get far because all the shit happened at once. And then exams happened. And I got way too busy to do anything. I think I edited like five seconds of it <laughs> during my exam period when I was like waiting for something. I was like, okay, can't, can't do more. Here's a trend. Now it's Kaiso Iron Iron one? What is Kaiso Iron one? Huh? I know there's this one dude on YouTube, Chess also knows him. I watch his videos uh, frequent, like every now and then, because he's like talking about certain things about Nuzlocke and, and like game strategics and stuff. And I think it's kind of interesting, even though I'm too dumb to <laughs> to pull that kind of shit off. But um, I'm not a nerd, can't do that. It's still fun to watch people who ha have like a lot of knowledge about games. Like some people might see that's really stupid, but in my opinion, if you're really passionate about games and you know a lot about it, I'm like really, really interested in listening to you. But I remember when I was like really into Assassin's Creed, I wanted to know everything about the game. Story-wise and all that. It's, I think it's really interesting to kind of listen to people who have a lot of ideas about Pokemon stuff. With hard stupid rules, do you really think that I could pull that over? <laughs> hard stupid? My brain would not be able to comprehend. <laughs> the emotional damage. I would be here for days. have a minute to talk about my lord and savior Gwent isn't Gwent a game from Witcher <laughs> alright the new Witcher will come out eventually as well right I wanna play that one as well I hope it's better than the last one I mean the last one was great but like I, I remember struggling so bad with the controls and not <laughs> There was a time when I was an expert in Gwent. Really? I never understood the game. I was always confused how it works. I never understood it. I tried to understand it, but somehow I just didn't. I just found the game really confusing. <laughs> That's nice. But you're a smart boy, so I'm not surprised. I only have smart boys in my chat. Smart boys talking to dumb girl. <laughs> I fuck fuck fuck. I did not mean to use the lens. I meant move this picture down, man. God damn it. <laughs> like you can only have one Pokemon and one HM friend. Friend? HM friend? You mean HM slave, sir? If you die, it's back to the beginning. Have you read? Yeah, yeah, I saw about that. I saw that. But but people often also use like uh, they have like a maximum amount of uh, what are they called rare candy, so they don't have to grind every time to make it a little little bit faster and not like. Because nobody wants to watch you grind, grind for like forever if you have to fail over and over to manage some manage something. <laughs> but yeah, I 
like I'm interested in watching people do that if they know what they're doing but I feel like if I did that you guys I don't know if you would enjoy that <laughs> can't grind no killing wild Pokemon ah ah okay just give me a gibble and I'll do the first two on each MC play. Hey, remember, technically, your gibble died before the Nuzlocke even started chess. <laughs> a lot of people would have made you restart on that part. It's good that we didn't set the rule that we start as soon as we die. It's good we set the rule that we are not allowed to start until we get our first Pokeballs. <laughs> You fine as long as you don't encounter a Vaparion, man. You rival cheated. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, but that Nuzlocke was a lot of fun. I enjoyed that a lot. <laughs> I like that. I feel like generally collabs with like friends I feel really comfortable with obviously a lot of fun even though like I literally didn't do collabs outside of like chess and my little sister <coughs> god damn it I choked on a piece of muffin earlier the floor is a bit fucked up I don't know anyone that have completed a Kaiser Ironman I know a couple of people who got to the last battle but back to the lab again oh boy <laughs> oh boy you want me to hi hydrate okay by the way I turned the um, item throwing thing off because I don't want my laptop to overheat in this weather. We have like 35 degrees or something at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> I went out with Maple a little bit today and she did not like it at all. She wanted to go back inside real quick. She was walking back and forth in the garden and was like, it's too warm. It's too warm. I think I saw her Pokemon speedrun with only an Emporion. I saw people do runs with Rasta Wooper. <laughs> but they didn't do Nuzlocke's, they just did rules to only use Wooper. And that kind of stuff is really interesting. Or like one hit not being hit once and killing stuff. Like the, the the kind of strategies people come up with is so is so fucking insane. It's admirable. admirable. <laughs> like I know that I wouldn't be able to do that. <laughs> it's impressive. Very impressive. Also, my little sister might. Ah. Uh, want to do a few streams with me in a bit because her model is done and my eyes are aging <laughs> she sorry um got herself a pc which is being built for her right now by someone who knows what he's doing <laughs> um built together at least so she will have something to use in order to actually be able to, uh, to, 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 to use her model. She's not sure what she will do stream-wise yet though. Probably mainly sell the games from what I remember. Oopsie. If all the parts are right already. Well basically what we did is my brother has a friend who builds PCs as a hobby and they kind of made them get a contact 
and uh, he asked. Well, basically, she told she told him everything that you told her, and then he helped her to kind of pick out things, and she sent them to you again, <laughs> so you could comment on it. And he ordered them so he could check if they are broken in case, and like send them back and and order new ones if that would happen. And yeah, I believe it's almost done. She only needs to order her screen still. And then she needs to get the PC, which most likely she will get from my brother when he comes here again at some point. Yeah, that's really nice of him. <laughs> she was like, she came over to my room all the time, first of all, because like... Uh, she wanted to ask you stuff, but she, she she kept telling me she feels really stupid for like asking stuff because she has absolutely no idea. And I told her, man, I don't know shit about PCs either. I ask smart people about that stuff as well, because I don't know. And before I bu buy some bullshit, I'd rather ask and feel stupid. <laughs> so yeah. even told her it's fine. He does it as a hobby. <laughs> but yeah. It's nice that she's getting one because like she actually needed one since she her laptop died. It should be good, I guess. I mean, you both looked into it, I think, right? I don't know how strong her laptop PC will be so uh, I'm really I'm too <laughs> she just told me that you said that the screen that she intended was a bit too extreme or something just told her it depends on what she wants in the end I believe like with PCs uh, changing out parts is obviously much easier than with laptops if something breaks and upgrading and all of that she told me there was something about a screen that was like 100 years less or something I also asked her like because the screen that she picked I think it has a curve and I was like I don't know anything about curved screens I just know that some people don't like them <laughs> but I can't say shit about it I don't know I only have normal screens so I wouldn't know Definitely too small, isn't it? Fuck. Da da oopsie. Boop It is orange and blue. That's the wrong color, girl. Got a huge S curved screen at work and main monitor now. It's also a bit curved. I don't really notice the curve anymore. What exactly is the purpose of the curve? Like, is it supposed to make stuff more comfortable? Because, like, I literally don't know. I think my brother got himself a slightly curved TV for some reason that I don't remember anymore. Uh, it's more the red than the orange, actually. Bought one, hated it, and got a refund. <laughs> I mean, I don't even know what I will want 
once I get myself a PC as well. I don't even know when I gonna get myself a PC. Because of the money stuff, you know. <laughs> it's likely more realistic for first person view, view I see. Does it have, have any impact on people with motion sickness such as myself? Do you know that by any chance? I'm curious about that. Has any neg negative or positive impacts? Anything more like that? That would interest me very much. Oops. <laughs> I'm waiting, still have some hope on price failing on someone. I don't think so that prices at the moment will sink for anything. They are just going up even further. Who knows what the prices during winter time will be for everything. <laughs> I don't have high hopes when it comes to prices, honestly. <laughs> because my PC is almost 10 years old. I think she paid like 2k something for hers. I don't know. Ah, that fucking no, but I hope that she can enjoy it. She's the first person in my family to get a PC. I remember when I was younger, I didn't know how to handle PCs because I never ever before school new PCs even existed. I only knew laptops and I did not know how to, how, how, how to turn a PC on. I was like how do I get this thing on? Why does everybody know how it works and then I sit there and I have no fucking clue. <laughs> I would need to change the motherboard. The CPU and RAM. Mm. <laughs> Prices are insane at the moment, yes. But I honestly doubt that they will go down anytime soon, sadly. Absolutely not. Time to pour a depresso. Meow. Wow. Meow, 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 meow. Motion sickness has more to do with the size of your screen. You want smaller screens or your eyes to just do less movement. Yeah, I was thinking like if I get a PC, I will have one bigger screen, especially for like art and stuff. And one smaller one that I have like on the side. Eventually I'd get a third screen because especially during art stre streams, I realized that two screens are not enough. <laughs> <coughs> Like if it wasn't for streaming, two streams are absolutely enough, but with streaming I feel like like I'm already tabbing around because I have three screens open basically right now. <laughs> but only two that I can like uh use. So yeah, that's that. <laughs> Maybe my experience here. To the blue pump, just a little bit more onto the purple. I'll see. Okay. My old PC was open like that. SSD for the win. Weep, weep. <laughs> yeah. No, I hope I can get a cool PC at some point as well. I don't know about the stupid prices and stuff at the moment, it's just a I would love to get my own place. I really do. Depressing that I can't. <laughs> Shit's too expensive. I'm 
wanna move out. Ah, yellow. Also, like, from what I heard from the person, I have a person in my university class who has the same laptop as I do. <clears throat> she also said that her laptop, after like two years of usage, kind of, despite the price and the the the, the uh, strength or whatever you call it, after like three years, it kind of gives up. Let me save. Beautiful name. Yes. Where the oxygen inhaling, mango eating, water drinking fellows at? Huh? <laughs> uh, I guess I guess I'm inhaling oxygen. I'm not eating mango right now, but I wouldn't mind sliced mango. Um, <clears throat> mango would be a name choice as well, but I don't I don't think I like the name mango. Mango, mango, mango. Welcome, by the way, uh, chance ball. Do you take any chances? Mangoes do be buzzing. They can be really nice. I went to a restaurant after my last exam. No, not my last one, my second last. The mango was fucking raw. I never. I ne raw. <laughs> It wasn't ripe. I have never had sour mango before. It was disgusting. It kind of tastes a little bit like kiwi and I don't like kiwi. Can I also be drinking oxygen <laughs> drinking water? <laughs> I mean, can you drink oxygen? Oxygen is... Oxygen is part of water. Kind of you can. I mean, you can drink it. I don't think you can have liquid oxygen though, can you? <laughs> You can inhale mango as long as you don't breathe it in. You can drink. Wait, what? What? Wait, what? Eat water in, if, you, if you eat ice cubes. There you go. Shred it. Unripe bananas. Yeah, I like them on the green side as well because they don't taste as much as bananas when they when they are still green. <laughs> and they are loft less soft. I hate soft bananas. They're disgusting. They hey, they are so sweet. <laughs> Then they're nice and green. Too mushy and sweet, I agree. Liquid o oxygen is a thing, is it really? I've never seen it. <laughs> Sub monkeys. Sub monkey yourself, Blue. You monkey of monkeys. Oh no. Wait. Fuck. Um. Okay, let me write the name on here so I don't forget. How did I do it last time? Wait, I don't remember. Why do I write your name? Your name is wrong, wrong, not wrong. What the hell? At eight. At most. Fox X Two thousand and one. There we go. Perfect. 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 Hey, green ones are nice and firm. They bite back when you bite. Them. What? <laughs> I have never been bitten by a banana, so what? What planet do you live on? <laughs> Minus 108 anti-trade. Yes, anti-trade new number. The bonk doesn't exist, so my laptop doesn't overheat. I'm sorry, Blue. I had to remove it for now. You will get it back once the weather goes down. 
there's no yeeting stuff at me for now. Last time I had it on during Stray, my laptop kind of Loki died. <laughs> Come back when it's winter. Well, what does my weather app say? Let me check real quick. No, I don't want to install the new software. Fuck off, phone. Stop forcing your updates on me. Well, next week is not really supposed to get much cooler, sadly. 29 degrees. Still over 30 here. Disgusting. I, <laughs> I hate this. Come back in two weeks. There you go. <laughs> And so in two weeks you probably have me screaming around because I will have a new cat or pro bro 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 most likely. There you go. Meow. Ah uh, Yes. I did I draw anything from anyone? I don't think I drew any of them from the front view. I don't like front views. Front views are really weird, I don't know man. Even though you can copy paste half of the face, I somehow prefer this idea. Yeah. There's so many foxes this time. I want to know the, 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 the evolutions of the starter Pokemon. Like I know that the cat will already be a disappointment because it's going to be humanoid again and I hate it. Why can't they leave the the the, 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 the the animals to be animals for once. I want my cat to say it's a cat and not turn into a half human. What what about all those man? Why they do this all the time? It's so depressing. I just want my kitty to stay a little kitty. I mean maybe maybe the the, the, the crocodile will end up looking cool, I don't know. Maybe Donald Duck. I'm not a fan of Donald Duck though. They do it for the furries. <laughs> Please, no. <laughs> a furry art makes me uncomfortable. The way that they draw body parts makes me shudder. I don't mean to disrespect them. People do what they want to do, but I prefer not to see certain things with my eyes. face from one certain angle. I don't remember what brush size I used. Where's my razor? God damn it, I used clip for one too long. I don't know how side works anymore. <gasps> Wait, I need to raise the face. Meow. There we go. Perfect. Command a croissant, secret fairy con no <laughs> Absolutely not. <laughs> Please no. Uh uh. <laughs> like, like, listen. I like characters that have like an animal f f f features, such as like cat ears or fox ears or like cute little fluff tails. But that's about it. It's nice, nice character design in my opinion. It has nothing to do with fairy. I don't even understand what exactly people always like. They're like different. Um, uh, what do you call it? Some people already already call people that like cat ears fairies, and I'm like, in my head, fairies are like as soon as the the, the, the body parts, like the hands and the feet, turn into like animal ones, not the ears. I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand them. I'm so confused. But uh, people make up weird rules and I don't understand them anyway, so I don't know about You are halfway there. <laughs> no. I I refuse. I was thinking about making a new design for my one year anniversary that is coming up next month. 
but I don't think I will make it in time. <laughs> it's impossible. Possible, sadly. Oh, wait, I did do front views. I did do front views. I did. What am I? What am I thinking? I don't think. When I know something that happened during my last presentation, I don't like this head shape. So, you know, my topic was about VTubers topic that a lot of people will consider really cringy which I can accept um, I cringe a little bit if I have to talk about like other people as well because like I like I like the idea of VTubing but I'm, I'm a personally like I don't know I like the people behind it and I'm not like fans of them because they are a VTuber but because of what they do, what they stand for, and that kind of shit, you know. Um. Anyways, why am I so bad at drawing faces today? It looks like mis misshaped fruit or something. <laughs> My 3D prof was like sitting in the very front row. The dude was sitting there with flip flops, right? And the moment. He heard me mention that I draw in a rather anime style. He rolled his eyes and then he looked at me with the most disgusted face I have ever been looked at in my entire life. And I was like, God damn it, dude, I know you work with Disney and shit, but pull yourself together. <laughs> Why are people always so offended when it comes to anime stuff? Like, seriously. It's just an art style. What wha what's people's problem? <laughs> what the what's the hate with like anime art style? Seriously, I don't I don't get it. I can understand if it's not your taste, but like being disrespectful about it is something else. Wait, missed the finding out. She's I'm not a furry. Shut up. <laughs> Why would you say that? I can smell my pineapple. God, why does it smell so sweet? Disgusting. It's a fox demon. Why does that make me a furry? I am not. If that makes me a furry, then Maple's a fucking furry because she's a furry animal. It's stupid. That makes everyone a fucking furry because we have body hair. It's bullshit. a cat <laughs> I the thing that I understand from fairies are people who wear those creepy ass suits and do nasty things in them that's what a fairy is in my eyes and I am I'm scared of them I'm scared of those cosplay people and like those huge animal costumes that 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 that, that walk towards you and then on like um, those big old events where like Companies have fucking fairies as mascots, so fucking creepy. <laughs> A croissant in disguise. <laughs> Fanatic fairy part. I don't know, that's just what I understand in fairies. To me, fairies are people that dress up as fairies because the, the, the term fairies is just so hella confusing to me. I don't know, man. Whenever people talk about fairies to me, they usually talk about the people and the costumes. So I, you know, I don't know, man. Uh -huh. Why are your people so slow at answering? Probably because they have a life. Not like me. <laughs> I try to answer ASAP whenever I read the message. No matter what I do. So having projected against the manga style is a no, but it seemed pretty. Yes. Jesus Christ, Barrett! I said I don't care what they are doing. I just want them to stay away from me because I'm scared of them. <laughs> the whole fairy aspect, like it's 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 like with everything. There are people who are respectful and they won't they they, they won't bug you with it, 
And then there are people who are just fucking creepy. What? <laughs> Do I know what my professor felt? Disgust, probably. <laughs> he was really interested in everyone who did like 3D stuff, but like he looked really disgusted. He didn't even look up once during my presentation after he said the word anime. Not once. And he was like sitting right in front of me. I felt a little bit insulted. <laughs> Weeps are creepy. I mean, I wouldn't call myself a weep just because I draw in a certain art style. I don't really watch anime. <laughs> I've been out of that phase. It's been quite a few years since I really watched anime. I watch one every now and then, and mostly because people force me to watch one. And the ones I watched are usually animes I watched like 200 times already and I just rewatched them because I know what's happening and then and I don't know <laughs> weird <laughs> Wow the prof is old yeah you know the thing the funny thing is he looks like he's almost as old as my father and my father is in his late 60s uh he has a daughter that's maybe three years old. And I'm like, no, not here to judge, sir, but you're a little old for a kid. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I mean, it's it's kind of sweet to know that he's capable of being a father, I guess. But at the same time, he's like the prof that everyone is fucking scared of. Because he will legit let you fail if he doesn't like you. He's that kind of prof. Who do you have long eyebrows? Gee, you have long eyebrows. Very long eyebrows. Uh, um, I mean, weeps are fucking creepy. Not gonna lie. Whenever I like see posts on Instagram about anime stuff, and I click on it because the art style look ni looks nice, and I'm kind of intrigued on what what that show is, I see some people commenting down there, and I'm like, yikes, you disgust me. <laughs> there are some creepy people out there. Profit thinks sweeps are creepy. I draw in manga style, I use a manga style avatar. I'm clearly not a weep. Wow. So now my, my, my art style is being discriminated. Are we discriminating the world right now? <laughs> a little bit more confused. We're reading the mangas. I mean, yeah, I like reading, okay? Is there a problem with that? I like to imagine the scenes in my brain rather than watching them most of the time. Not to mention I ca I have the freedom to imagine the voices and, and all that stuff. When I'm reading it and most of the time when you watch something the voices are a pure disappointment. If you watch them in Japanese stuff, the girls all sound like they are like producing a porn or something while they are just walking. And the guys always shout constantly. They just scream your ear out. That's like Japanese dub in a nutshell to me. And then you have German, which can be a masterpiece or it can be so bad that you can't watch it with a straight face. Or you can't watch it at all because it's just so obviously bad. <laughs> and English is kind of the same. Sometimes it's a masterpiece, sometimes it's meh. And other times you just like, what the fuck did you do in the studio, man? <laughs> Clearly not a weave. <laughs> Can you guess the last anime I watched, the last manga I read? shit you wouldn't <laughs> I think the only anime that I can think of that are good in German are Full Metal Alchemist Death Note and Code Geass they are really good in English as well though all three of them, like no Death Note I have no fucking idea if Death Note is good in English never watched it in English but it's really good in German actually 
I like the German death note. And that's a rare thing for me to say, praising German men. <laughs> really rare thing for me to say. Last manga. Record of... What is that? Is that actually a manga? <laughs> I never heard the name. There are actually a few mangas that I would like to read, but I'd never got to pick them up. The last manga I actually read is... What was the name of it? Eden Zero, the guy from Fairy Tale. The manga is actually kind of good. I tried watching the anime and I hated it because the music in the anime is just fucking garbage. I'm so sorry. Whenever I hear the music, I just cringe to death. I want to, I want to, I want to just, just vanish whenever I hear the music in in the in the anime adaptation. And the voices, no, please, I can't watch the anime. It's so bad. I couldn't watch Fairy Tale either because the anime in my eyes was just was it was trash. I'm sorry. <laughs> the manga was like beautifully drawn, especially later on when you saw him like create his own art style and stop trying to fucking copy the One Piece guy and I hate One Piece's art style so bad. I hate the way they draw women. I just really hate the way they draw women in One Piece. I have a disgust for that. Uh, I'm glad that he adapted his own art style. And it was an int like that's one thing I really love about mangas as well. Like you can watch the manga create his own art style. You can really see that over time with every manga you read. They all develop their art style. <laughs> I can't blame you, it's a bit odd, but like watching them um, develop their art style is really nice in my opinion. I enjoy seeing that. Um I don't know, I feel like I don't I I I, I didn't watch a lot of fairy tale. I remember like the early episode looked like really cheaply produced. The backgrounds looked like clay dough uh, and the, the, the coloration and all that kind of crappy. I think it got better later on but in the beginning it was a big external for me watching it. Also Happy's voice is just... God, somebody shoot that cat. I hate that cat so fucking much. I hate those little stupid talking animal companions in shows. Doesn't matter which show it is. I fucking hate them. Same with like, I watched a lot of One Piece. I hate Chopper. He's like my least favorite character. They always have those high pitched stupid as voices and they are always hella annoying. I hate them so much. <laughs> this is like a trope I absolutely dislike in shows. Please keep those annoying little creatures away from me. So an image and looked same character with a yeah literally that's but like that's literally the fairy tale dude he his characters <laughs> if you see his like first works they kind of look like the current char characters as well he just changes the hair color a bit and like the hairstyle slightly but uh, they always look kind of the same yeah <laughs> I still have to watch the second season. I didn't watch that one yet. I only finished the manga like when it was done. Mm. I just remember that like there was a spoiler released for One Piece at some point and I I remember stopping watching it because it just got boring to me because the story never ends and somehow there are so many episodes and at some point I'm like <sighs> I lose interest at some point. Like, I stopped watching Naruto as well, for example. I finished it by reading the manga because my brother kept buying it whenever a new one was released. And I remember when the manga was done, the anime wasn't even at the war arc yet. Like, seriously. <laughs> so many fillers. <laughs> so bad. They really ruined the shows for me with that shit. It's disgusting. Like 
One Piece is kind of similar. There's so many arcs in One Piece that I just dislike, and I can't watch through them, and I kind of have to to understand the story, you know? I just remember that Sorrow was my favorite character. I like Sorrow. I don't even remember shit about him anymore. I just don't. I know, just know that he was my favorite character. <laughs> I know that I didn't like Nami, and I know uh, Ruffy was so basic that I didn't really care shit about him. Chopper I dislike, Zanji is hella annoying, I have a problem with horny characters. Uh, Robin is cool, I guess. I like Ace. Favorite character, and he's the reason why I dropped the show completely. <laughs> I was like, well, fuck that shit. I'm not gonna continue it. <laughs> nope. The character that made me actually watch the show died off. And I'm like, nah, I don't need that. Fuck off. <laughs> yeah. Never watched One Piece. I kind of, I had it on the sh I, I saw it on TV a lot when I was younger. Same with Naruto. But I don't know. One Piece just gets boring because I feel like do they even ever mention like I mean they probably mentioned the One Piece but is, does anything ever happen that actually like I don't know man brings them closer or is it always just something happens you think something happens but nothing really happens and then you just keep going and you don't know if the story is ever going to end or if, <laughs> I don't know man I just lose interest at some point. I'm not intrigued to keep watching if, it, if it's always the same stuff over and over and over and over. It's like... Like my problem with fairy tale, for example as well is it's always the same loop happening. You can kind of see that he didn't intend the manga to be this long. Because fairy tale is always... Okay, you have your main cast, he eventually adds people because the fans would like that person to be a main character. Uh, even though he didn't intend it at first. And then there's like an evil group, and then they defeat the evil group. The evil group doesn't matter shit anymore. And then there's a new evil group, and then that evil group gets defeated, and then that evil group doesn't matter shit anymore. <laughs> and that's just how the story of fairy tale goes on and on and on and on and on. And I just get bored of that at some point. With this new story, he at least makes the heroes lose every now and then. They suffer consequences, main characters die, like even if you don't know if they die like for forever, if there's some time shit going to happen that like brings them back. But at least they suffer consequences. And it's not like, oh my god, you're the main character, you cannot die, you know. <laughs> boring if you know what's going to happen if you know what you, you have you can expect it's, it's not fun if they only cut um, kill off characters that are like basically side characters I mean if it's your favorite character like in my case in ca my case ace for one piece it's, it's sad that he dies but does it really matter no it doesn't matter shit because he's not a main character <laughs> I don't know Why do they draw her so uh, side angled? What's wrong with me? Why? The fuck? Um, I think I'm gonna draw it again. I don't like this. What the fuck? No! But there are also so many animes that I still kind of wanna watch. I also notice a lot, like, if you go on Netflix. I don't know if you guys still have Netflix. Um, sometimes I'm like, hmm, okay, maybe I give this show a chance, right? Why is it that 99% of the shows on Netflix are utter garbage? The story is just so bad, they drop every hint at the beginning, every big plot point they could play with. It's just dropped at the start. Like, why would you do that? What's the story? <laughs> like, I suck at writing, but man. What's the purpose of watching something if you already know everything? 
it's not interesting. You can't figure stuff out. You just know, oh yeah, he's Satan, by the way. Th thanks for telling me, I guess. <laughs> Great job. That's the reason I hardly watch anime anymore. I used to... Oh, Mabel. Your baby went on the floor because it's too hot. <laughs> baby. You melting on the floor, my little baby. Cute baby. Main. I agree, it's too hot. It's actually the, the, the fault of the season that she stopped sleeping in my bed with me. She used to sleep there until last year's summer because it was too fucking hot. Stop sleeping in bed with me. It's really sad. I miss that sometimes. Hope my new kitty sleeps in bed with me. That would be great. <laughs> Do you guys have any absolutely favorite animes though? Or shows in general? Are you guys excited or even interested in a new Game of Thrones show? I just how the fuck do I always hurt myself without wanting to? Jesus Christ, man. Go away. Don't do that, man. Kind of interested what they will do with the new Game of Thrones show since they have the entire book, so they should have less chances of fucking it up. Hopefully. But at the same time, I don't know. I'm not really excited about it. <laughs> you say that. I say what? I say what? They won't fuck it up. Uh, who knows? They already have a few fans raging because they... I mean... I think I've ever finished an anime. I did finish cartoons. Castlevania was amazing. Isn't Castlevania an anime as well? Does that count as ca cartoon? I don't know, man. People feel so offended if you call certain things anime. <laughs> People hope that... Why? I... Give me a second. My, my, my little sister just wrote me. This little bitch. I don't even know. Well, I see Japanese influences. The Castlevania didn't have that. Fair enough. I just know there are sex scenes in it. <laughs> I didn't watch it though. I I just kind of uh, my little sister was watching it while she was eating uh, lunch. Because you always watch something while eating lunch, and I just kind of came into the room while there was stuff going on. <laughs> I was like, okay, that's way to eat your dinner, I guess. <laughs> so, I mean, I find it really hard. Like, anime is just a short version of animation, you know. To me, it's kind of the art style that puts anime and cartoon apart. It's just in my eyes. I know that a lot of people don't see it like that. But like in my eyes, anime style and cartoon style are two very um, certain uh, art styles. I think Castlevania is more semi-realistic though. So yeah, I don't know. <laughs> You guys sh should should watch Great Pretender. Great Pretender is a great anime. It's playing in like uh, Europe most of the time, I think, and the USA. I don't know. I mean, Japan. It, it's kind of playing all over the world, I believe. But it has like very Western influence when it comes to music and stuff. And I think the main characters is a really colorful mix between different places. French guy, there's a Japanese guy, there's a... I'm not sure where exactly she's from and a French girl. <laughs> Wait, is she French? I'm not even sure. Might be. 
I have like different different types of enemy like gymnasium enemy Shield by the eyes. Yeah, kind of. It's I don't know, man. It's not. <laughs> I know that people always there's there's people who take like the categorization of anime and all that way too serious. To be honest, there are people like that, which is why I'm usually really hesitant about calling shows a certain way. My little sister tends to get really angry if I say shows, though. Because I got so used to calling anything a show, it, it doesn't matter if it's anime or cartoon or anything like that. I call it a show because I don't want to categorize it. And whenever I say show, she gets really mad at me because she's like, show to her is a real life series with like real life people and all that. And I'm like, well, I don't know what to call stuff anymore. <laughs> no matter what you say, people always feel offended, you know. I don't know how to draw this, so I'm gonna just draw a flower. With like... That. I remember when I was younger, I refused to watch like real life stuff. Just because, I don't know. I have no idea why. Because I was a child. <laughs> I just wanted to watch anime and cartoons only. No idea why. <laughs> but I do remember that. I remember distinctly I refused to watch anything with real life people in it. I don't remember shit why though, really. And then a friend of mine kind of forced me into Game Fronts. Well, a few friends actually. And I liked it. And then I got into interested in CGI stuff. And then I applied to my university and I suck at 3D. <laughs> but I still think it's really, 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 really cool. I admire people who are good at it. Maybe I will be too one day. Maybe. Or not. I don't know. <laughs> I just think it's cool. I'm mesmerized by the kind of shit. Like, I watched uh, certain old Disney movies recently. And I'm so amazed by the fact that, like, I they are not that old, actually. But they developed their techniques so, f so much. Like, they are so much better now in doing certain things, and like, it's kind of impressive to watch stuff that isn't even that old, but it kind of looks like trash to today's standards. It's really amazing, actually. I mean, the only reason I like Game of Thrones so much is because of the music and the 3D stuff. I love the wolves and the dragons and the effects. And I love the behind the scenes stuff they always do. <clears throat> of anything. So interesting. Love that shit. I also watched the behind the scenes of Witcher. It's cool as fuck. <laughs> so easy to entertain, man. There's so much going on. I don't know what's going on here. What is going... Oh, that's supposed to be a hairstyle. I see. I'm so slow today, I'm so sorry. <laughs> I'm not getting anywhere. I haven't drawn in too long, man. I have not drawn in too long. I mean, I kind of did a did little bit of scribbling and sketching, but I can't call a drawing. That's not the same. Fuck. God damn it. That is not the same. Na na na. Na na na. No no no. No no. Up. What up? Mabel. My 
tablet is fusing with my legs as well. I understand your suffering, baby. I do, I truly do. You don't understand what I'm saying, but I don't care. <laughs> Today my little sister told me how annoying I am whenever I start talking to my t to my cat and I start meowing at her sometimes. And I'm like, blame the cat, not me. She's the one who starts it. Usually if she meows at me, I will meow back at her. I don't care. <laughs> People can call me weird. I love my kitties. They are the cutest babies in the world. Cute little baby, I want... I wanna, I wanna do collabs with my friends. But do you have short hair? You do have short hair. God dang, you have short hair. Well, it's not short, it's still long, but you get what I mean. I get what I mean. I thought it's really long, maybe because I always draw myself long as hair. <laughs> Remember when I was young, I wanted my hair to grow all the way to the bottom of the floor. Well, that never happened. <laughs> that never happened. No, no, it didn't. I don't even think that would look good. So, maybe it's better that way. Too long hair isn't pretty either. At least that's my opinion. Looks weird. It looks kind of weird when you're when you're small like I am, and then your hair is like way too long. It makes me look even even weirder. <laughs> Do you have a? Oh, that's a color. I see. I see a color. Nice, nice. Okay. I see. And then you have a little circle bird. And I get hurt by my stupid cable man. Never watched past one film of Twilight because it's crap. Hello, all boogies. Welcome to my. Uh, I am back from the dead <laughs> stream. I is alive, I guess. Hee <laughs> hee. Zombie croissant, absolutely. It's so rotten inside. Fits me perfectly. Oh wait, there's more going on. I'm not done yet. Gee, I thought I'm done. <laughs> um, here's a hairpin. And there's a hairpin. And there's a chain or something hanging down on it. Finally, shut up. I've been dead for a while. We are all been dead. Welcome to the living. <laughs> I'm at this very moment still dying because it's so fucking hot over here. It's over 30 degrees. I suck at drawing flowers, if it isn't obvious. Yes, beautiful. We just pretend like this is a pretty flower, okay? <laughs> been busy with learning art nice making any progress I mean yes you do if you're learning it but you know <laughs> uh, no there are more flowers no so bad at this they look like I don't know what they look like but they do not look like flowers <laughs> gee wait there's something like this going on I love your details, but I'm too stupid to draw them right now because I'm trying to draw a chibi. Girls, girls are outside. Hello, Mushi. Mushi? Mushi yo? <laughs> Mushi yo. Hi. Did I miss anything? Um, I don't think so. 
So who are you drawing? Uh, Sarakura Misaki on Twitter. I'm drawing random people right now because it's so hot. I cannot I cannot come up with stuff right now. It's too warm. Too warm outside. I will distinguish. I would die. <laughs> Look, I I think for the hydrate. One second. Have a good lurking. Thanks for chicken. Bye. Wait, when did she say she's on the fucking train station? Okay, I still have time. I still have time. Wait, what was I doing? Coloring, right? Hello. Uh, uh, uh. Wait, I'm I'm too stupid to fucking talk right now. Fukuraku, if I'm right with that pronunciation. <laughs> Welcome. I think this first first stream I've attended, right? Uh, according to chat, yes, it is. Chat says first time chat. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, why is it still kind of Mabel? You were having a heat stroke, little girl. I still wanted to come in. My brain doesn't work today. It's too warm. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you can call me Fukuro. Fuku. Sure. Fuku. Oh god. Oh god. I'm so glad that I have a cushion on my chair because I'm melting into my chair right now. Poop. <laughs> I need a fan in my room. Blow some air at me, man. Mine is broken. You've seen me before on YouTube. That's new to me. I, I had people come from Twitter and from Instagram. I don't think there were people from YouTube before. Interesting. It's nice that you found me via YouTube. <laughs> I just upload my bots there, so there's not, not that much interesting stuff, I guess. I'm working on cutting the videos together, but I'm rather busy lately. What should draw my friend on boobies? Ah, it's been a while ago. Nice. I hope you like the stream. <laughs> what in that case? Mabel hey, gave you fresh water, baby. You can drink some water. Oh, baby. Are your eyes suffering? Come here, you got some treat because you're so fucking cute. This is normal for my streams, by the way. My cat likes to come here and be adorable. <laughs> Waifu. Cosmic Fox? A waifu. This is my waifu is another term for my best friend. Mm. <laughs> I call her my waifu, yes. That's my best friend. She didn't start streaming yet, but she plans to do it at some point. Um, I rigged her model quite a while ago. Just the right brush, I think so. Yeah. What's her birthday gift? Maybe baby, it's so too warm for the little baby. Understandable. Please don't start screaming. I cannot open the door right now. Maple. Maple is a free colored cat though. She's a cute baby. I think I have pictures of her post all over my Instagram and my Discord. Not my Instagram, my Twitter. Actually. <laughs> She's my little two-year-old calico cat. It's usually in my room when I'm streaming and sometimes she attacks the door because it's too warm and she wants to get outside. <laughs> Especially with the sweater right now. I can't blame her, honestly. I myself am getting heating up way too much. Such a cute name. <laughs> Thank you. There's so many names I had in store for her, but she's a really uh, cheeky little, cheeky little girl. I think Maple fits her pretty well. She's like a really tomboyish cat. Myself just started out, so I'm kind of still a little bad at it. Just starting it is really good, though. We all started like I was really bad at art as well for 
like a long time you only get good if you like try really hard and you have the ambition to do it and it's a really nice feeling looking back at some point knowing that you made process and there's nothing wrong if you ever get like stuck somewhere and you think that you're like doing something right and you end up realizing that you're not that's something that happened to me on my art journey a lot <laughs> it doesn't matter yeah progress is really different with every person but i think it's really nice when people try to pick up the pen and get better okay i'm back apparently i'm back okay, cool. <laughs> i think it will be cute and fun mm -hmm. if you have like a certain personally i didn't really oh god fuck what was that I didn't have a specific art style in mind when I started drawing. I just had artists that I really looked up to and I tried to understand how they do stuff. And I kind of like tried to copy their art so I would learn an anatomy. But everyone learns kind of different. If you find a way that really helps you then go for it. <laughs> as long as you don't... Welcome back. Okay, I'm back. Good, good. Where's my tab? I just suddenly was gone. I just went poof. <laughs> poof. What color? It's red. It is red, baby. Studying's back. Okay, good. I wasn't sure. Because sometimes it's telling me I'm back. Yeah, but you guys don't respond. And then I'm not sure what is going on. If I'm actually back or if the yap is lying to me. Sometimes, yeah, it doesn't happen that often anymore. Though it happened a lot when I first started streaming almost a year ago. Uh, because my internet used to be really, 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 really bad. It just sometimes happens now. And other times it's Twitch's fault because Twitch sometimes is a bitch and just has issues. <laughs> likes to be a piece of shit sometimes but like my streams are rather stable these days <laughs> the only problem is that I really don't know when I'm back because if I refresh my twitch and my app is telling me I'm back I would think I'm back but most of the time I don't really get response from anyone and I like don't know if I'm back yet for 100% which kind of sucks to be honest Kind of really sucks ass, man. Ah. But yeah, it happens sometimes. You can have air to use every now and then. Also, one thing that my laptop likes to do is sometimes it just decides I'm not getting internet today. It just sometimes decides to cut off the internet completely and I don't know why it does that. The only thing that I realize is that somehow turning my laptop off and on doesn't help but restarting it sometimes does fix the issue. So weird. <laughs> I plan to show my complete art journey on this account. That's nice. I have it on a set different account but I prefer people not to see it. <laughs> But if people find it, I'm not mad. It's not that hard, actually. There are a lot of things you guys can find out about me if you really try. It's not, and they don't even have to really try it. <laughs> it's not like I'm some, I don't know. <laughs> the things I don't mention on stream are actually, uh, certain things that I don't mention on stream are actually mentioned on, my, on, on, on certain, certain places already. It's not a secret to the world anymore. <laughs> Post most of my art on Twitter so even if I don't draw on stream Yeah, personally I don't really like Twitter for posting art because in Twitter on Twitter your posts vanish so easily. Uh, because of you know if you like something or you comment on something or retreat something 
it all goes into your Twitter uh, media. Yeah. Personally, like, I also use Instagram for art because of that. Because Twitter just kind of makes your stuff dis disappear. You have to scroll forever to find anything. Uh, can I please get my pen back? Oh, shit. <laughs> For five months, that's nice. Being consistent. I think art journeys are very interesting to watch, really. Always makes me happy when people try to get better at it. Always makes me think, like, maybe I should really... I don't know how easy it is with, for example, singing complete... What the fuck is my brain thinking? Compared... <laughs> Compared to art, like I want to get good at singing because I suck at it, but I don't know if you can really get that good without a singing teacher. I know you can good, get good at art without an art teacher. In my experience, art teachers teach you a lot of stuff that you don't need. Because other than singing, art can be anything. <laughs> if you don't sing well, anyone will hear that you cannot sing well because it's obvious to the ear. Singing takes a while, yeah. Takes a lot of learning and actual practice in another sense. Which is I, I which is why I think if people like wanna learn something, I, I, I encourage you to go for art because because in my eyes art is something everyone can learn. Because art can be literally anything. Which is kinda beautiful in my opinion. Just having a video model is art, man. <laughs> you know, I have like, wait, let me count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12 tabs open with characters I wanna draw. And I'm like at 2 out of 14. <laughs> singing I feel like it's really difficult without a teacher but really with art really just try to, to, to learn from people and also if you have like artists that like are very advanced don't get encouraged because they are out of almost everyone's league there are so many amazing artists that it's so hard to learn their skill set <laughs> draw my PNG but my PNG is my C. Give don't drink credit to all the artists. Yeah, giving credit is really important. I think it's also really cute when people ask before using something because in my opinion like also experience that doesn't happen too often sadly. It's really sweet and it also makes most artists really happy. Others are like really paranoia about their stuff but you shouldn't take that as an insult towards yourself. That's just how some people are for all um, reasons that have nothing to do with you. Kuroko is a character and another artist spent forever thinking of nails first. That's really nice. <laughs> Gee. Sitting is uncomfortable when it's so warm, really, man. I don't think I can see your PNG on here though. I can see it over the with the chat. No. Me too. God, I hope I don't get yeeted somewhere when I click on your name. <laughs> Load. Can't see much because it's pretty small from here, but it looks cute. I like it. Close close the window. <laughs> 
Gib mal ja wie jetzt ab. Aua. Bigger art without the watermark girl also asked them to mark it. That's really sweet of you. Like personally I used to give away my art without watermark after it was done. But I stopped doing that at some point because I know that some people they might not have bad intentions, but it can happen that the art gets stolen and it, 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 it sucks for both people. For you and for the person it was drawn for. So yeah, personally I just keep the watermark on ever since then. But I used to also remove it for people that like kind of got something from me. Either gift or something else, since I never really got commissions. <laughs> What's the name? Sarakura. Sarakura. Sa Go. That's two characters. Crediting uh, people is really important. It's sad that so many people. I hate it when I see, especially like on Instagram, when people repost reels, for example. It's really sad to see when they intentionally remove the watermark. Like, really. It's just really sad. Depressing. to hear that it's an honor <laughs> glad when people like my stuff that much it's, it's pretty sweet it is very sweet can ever sing like high tones i gonna sing the song from princess mononoke for you guys but if that day ever comes is the real question <laughs> because it's hard to put Suki and watermark together. Yeah, 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 I understand, don't worry. I'm not mad if you stop using it either. It's People get their stuff and change it at some point, so yeah. <laughs> I don't blame people for anything. Like, I'm not mad at it. If the picture did its job, I'm happy enough with it. What all languages do no, I know English and German. Sadly, I wish I knew more. <laughs> I could do a stream where you guys teach me phrases. I know I have some Dutch, British, Spanish, and where? Oh God, no! I don't want to sound. Wait, what? I don't want to sound stupid. <laughs> Different people here. German, yes, I am. Uh, I am from Germany. <laughs> English is my second language, but I prefer talking it over German way much more. Very much so. Well, I want to learn Japanese, but with art, I don't have enough time to learn it. Understandable. I would like to learn French and Japanese. I used to want to learn Latin, but Latin is like a useless language unless you intend to become a doctor or something because nobody speaks fucking Latin. <laughs> it just sounds cool. 
and it's hard as fuck to learn. So, uh, yeah, no. Not gonna happen, man. No Latin for me. I just think it's a cool language. I am from Germany. Why, yes, splendid! Please don't be able to aware that I am very much German indeed. I hated my German accent. I try to uh, get rid of it as much as I can. <laughs> I get told I have a German accent and I guess I do, but I don't know. I, 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 I just know my accent isn't as bad as like people that don't speak English as often or don't use English as often in general. 99% of my friends are English speaking, so... My best friend is from Austria, actually, but we don't talk that much. That's what best friends do, right? We don't talk that much. We don't talk that much, but we love each other very much. Just like all my friends. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> what am I doing? love lemons my little sister is a lemon <laughs> lemons make a good drink lemons make my teeth hurt i am very sensitive to sour stuff i can't even i used to really like eating apple apples i fucking can't talk today apples 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 but at some point i had to stop because it made my teeth hurt teeth teeth my teeth <laughs> My teeth hurt like shit. Like so bad. So so got them bad. <clears throat> it's very sad. I have two sisters and two brothers actually, in fact. But only one sister when she's the li literally the only sibling that ever makes an appearance on my streams. <laughs> I have a few streams that she appeared in already. I think she was part of one um, Breath of the Wild stream and I played Untitled Goose Game with her on my birthday this year. Was there another stream that she was part of that I don't remember? Oh yeah, right, I played Kirby with her. The entire Kirby stream was with her. <laughs> Meow. Meow. Meepo. Do I get a meow? I don't get a meow anymore. Right, then the meow meow. Why did a meow meow? Eh. I have such a big family. My twin sometimes pops into my stream. <laughs> I always get told that my little sister and I sound almost identical, and that makes it kind of hard for people to tell us apart on stream. <laughs> To me, she and I don't sound anything alike, so that's kind of funny, honestly. Me, boy, I don't really want to let you out of the room right now, because I cannot watch over you, girl. Meow. If you would let me fetch this one at least, Mabel. I wanted to draw at least two more. Oh, your sister's such a cool design. She does? <laughs> She's just a lemon. <laughs> Did I post her character design anywhere? Did I? I don't think so. She has a model as well though. I, I made a model for her, but she can't use it yet because she doesn't have a, a PC that can handle a YouTube studio. Everyone says me and my twin look the same and have the same voice. Hmm. Yes, it's similar with like some pets. People always say they look the same, but they actually don't at all. Maple. Go go scratch on the scratching tree, good girl. Go destroy that motherfucker. <laughs> Meow. Meow. 
Why is it so fucking warm? I'm dying, man. <laughs> We're not identical. Yeah, people just... I feel like with siblings in general... Mabel, shush. I feel like with siblings in general, people always go like, Oh, you look just like your sibling. And I'm just like, no, we don't. <laughs> I hate this. Why is it so ugly? It's the face. It's the face. Mabel, shush. Don't be dramatic, girl. You're not dying. Don't scream like that. Ah, it's too big. Mabel, don't, don't. You, you will fall down. Don't do that. I can see you. Oh god. What the fuck did you do? <laughs> I would like drawing flash fangs. They're so cute. Yeah, they are. They really took it. Look adorable. <laughs> Oh my back, gee Christ man, I'm a grand. <laughs> Incredibly different, yeah. I mean siblings tend to look somewhat al alike, but I guess to outside people, it's hard to tell. Let's see stuff like that easily, I guess. I don't like this, go away. Go away! I don't like you. Stupid face. It freaked out because I moved my head a little bit too much. <clears throat> uh, I kind of lifted myself up from the chair. Uh, that just happens, <laughs> the model thing. Whenever I do that, because I was kind of sinking into my chair because it's so warm in my room, and then my back started to hurt, and that's why I changed position. And my camera goes like, "Woo!" <laughs> I don't want you to look like you're looking up, girl. Stop. Stop. You're supposed to look happy. Not like you're looking at someone. Everybody. Somebody. Ah, oh, fuck. I forgot she has no internet. Fuck. Shit. Wait, when? I still have time. This is, this is fine. This is fine. I still have time. Everything's alright. Um, start screaming at me in 10 minutes, please. <laughs> in case I forget. <laughs> you know what? I just look back at my first digital drawing and then look at my knees. Noticed I've made much bigger improvement than I realized. Yeah, that's uh, something. There, there used to be a trend on deviant art. Like I started out on deviant art with my art journey. Back then, when deviant art wasn't just the fucking graveyard. <laughs> um. And I remember there was this trend where you would draw something again after a few years, like a certain art piece. And I did that once, and it's always in, in, in incredible to see how much you've actually improved. Because as you draw, you don't actually realize that you're improving at some point. You feel like you're stagnating, but in fact, you're actually getting better at something. Like, personally, I feel like my art style did not change much since, I don't know, a long time now. I feel like I'm kind of drawing the same way as I did many years ago, but I actually got so much better with uh, body shapes and all that. I just didn't realize it. You do improve and learn on your way, you just at some point you kind of get blind and think you don't make any progress actually. It's just my experience at least with art.
I don't understand your horn, ma'am. Such a cute little girl. Get out there, this line girl. Good line. Mm. No, no, what? I'm not allowed to be a slack. Why not? What's your problem? Do you have an issue with slack, sir? <coughs> that I haven't talked that much in a long time because my voice dies so much easier. Like, I haven't been here that much, have I? Today. I mean, I just see it, so my stream is parted again and I fucking hate when that happens, but oh well, what can you do? Nothing. You're a busy demon. I tried to be outside a bit with Maple today and she hated it. She just wanted to go back inside. <laughs> Can't blame her though. Place. Just work the way I want to. You stupid, stupid little drawing boy. Even here, it is still 25 degrees. I don't want to know the temperature in my room. I just know that I am freaking hot right now. Yeah, kind of the same, at least outside. Apparently, the stars are very visible at the moment. That's pretty. I'm actually surprised we didn't get any thunderstorms because at night, it, it, it gets pretty fresh outside. Compared to the daytime, it's kind of weird that we didn't get any storms. Hey! Okay. Hiccups. <laughs> Come on, bitch. Move. Mabel, why are you so cute? I love you so much. Cute little kitty cat. Get yourself someone who loves you as much as I love my pets. <laughs> Spoiler, person like that does not exist. <laughs> I kind of really want to play all the games I got from Summer Say, but at the same time, there are like so many other games I also want to play, and I'm like, man, I can't make myself everything because I still have priorities I also was thinking about like setting some streams on the weekend for example earlier but I don't know how that goes with you guys if it's like better for you guys or like worse like of course I could get like new people to join the cult if I stream at different times, but I care more about the people I have already than new people, honestly. But then again, growing a community is part of the whole process, isn't it? <laughs> I don't know, man. It ain't. I don't know. I would probably only go early on the weekends as well, because, like, within the week. I prefer to do the work like early on so I'm done with it. So I don't want to 
stream in the morning or anything like that because I have to do my part-time job stuff. So I'm done with it. And I don't have to do it anymore for the rest of the day. <laughs> it's kind of how my brain works in that manner. Ow! I'm stuck to the chair. <laughs> I also have a mosquito somewhere in my room. I just don't know where the fucking bitch is, but I know it's here. Oh no. Back. Yes. Maple. <laughs> Maple is laying on her bed, enjoying the air that is coming through the window right now. Cute little baby. Cute little baby. My little Maple. You are a baby. And everyone loves you, Maple. Do you know that? Everyone fucking loves you. I post you anywhere and people just love you. My little sister posts her somewhere and people love her. Everybody loves Maple. But that's understandable. Maple is perfection. Maple is baby. Maple is a cutie pie. Sometimes bites me. And that's not so cute anymore. <laughs> Cause she cute as fuck. You rap about that boy. She cute as fuck, bro. Maple! Maple! <laughs> Yes, get up the window, girl. It's, it's nice and fresh up there. You really like the wrong character to stand on. Am I being bullied again because of the ears? <laughs> Are we going to have that conversation again? Uh, I just randomly picked people that I recently followed actually on uh, Twitter. Has nothing to do with the ears, I swear. Sounds like I'm trying to make excuses. <laughs> I'm not though. I'm just existing. Kind of. Jesus Christ, why is it so fucking hot in here? Because I'm in here. Huh. No, I'm not that kind of person. <laughs> Don't be that kind of person. I'm not. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck. Who's a good boy? Not you. One second, I see the messages pop up. I'm trying to draw though. Is it orange? It is orange and yellow. Mustard. No, Baronet, stop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being bullied. Stop it. Didn't deserve this. <laughs> Cruelty. This is Lilith abuse. Stop it. Stop abusing me. I can't draw them, but they are cute as the flash fangs. Yes. I like horns. There you go. The character I'm drawing right now has horn horns. It's not the true <laughs> stuff. <laughs> the more I try to talk about it, the more I, I sound like I'm trying to make excuses. <laughs> this is not fair. <laughs> Isn't the love meant to be a kitsune? Where does she and remind me more of a cat because I'm a cat person probably. I I have fox ears. Uh, I'm I'm a croissant. A croissant. <laughs> I'm not even French, I'm an insult. There we go. That's, that's what I am. I like horns. Mother just left, so it's all good. Okay. As long as I don't need to be worried about my shit, everything is fine. Uh, the yes. Go 
could have made myself a cat, I guess, but I didn't want to. Felt too generic, even though foxes are very generic as well, if you think about it. Just look at look at all the fox characters out there. But foxes are so cute, I like foxes. I love desert foxes, they are the fucking most adorable fox there is. Look at those huge ears they have, it's so cute. So fucking cute. I fucking love it. Love those those cute big ass fox ears and those tiny bodies they have. It's such a fucking cute the, the combination. You cannot tell me otherwise. You're a liar if you tell me otherwise. Mm -hmm. <laughs> if it wasn't for the fact that it's animal abuse, I would love a kitsune as a as a pet. Desert fox. I like croissants with like chocolate inside, even though I'm not a chocolate fan, but croissants without anything are fucking boring. I find at least. Let her be ripening. Why not add a fox to your zoo? <laughs> I would never because they are so destructive and generally they are wild animals. It, it's not it's something that belongs in the house. Oh, that's who on the thumbnails of your streams. <laughs> Lelof Zoo. Absolutely. Ah, yes, I, I know. Ah, I know. Let's do this. Shrink, baby, shrink. Yes, your face looks so flat. Just like my taste. <laughs> ah. What breed was Egg Dog? Uh, Pomeranian. The person on the top, I feel like I've seen them. I don't know. That's their username. I will I will add them later on Twitter when I post this so you can you can check them all out. They have all very cute designs. I don't know them as a person, so I can't judge them, but I really like their design. <laughs> That's usually what I go for when I follow people. And if I get to know them, that's a bonus, I guess. But I tend to follow them because they have cute designs. <laughs> uh, there we go. There we go. Uh, might be. Oh. 
Who invented summer? Curse them, man. Curse them. Oh, I hate it. I mean, for now, we should be happy on summer, I guess. But I hate summer. I want to wear my cute baggy winter clothes that look fucking adorable. I love winter clothes. Nobody convinced me otherwise. Winter fashion is so much better than any other fashion. Winter fashion is just superior. Looks so cute. And it's so comfy. You can... You can become one with your blanket and you don't unnecessarily sweat and get sticky every fucking day and have to shower 20 times a day. You followed me. Face shave is all, but whatever, I guess for right now, this is fine. I shall draw you a smiley face. Yes. Yes, indeed, you worship. Please don't take that as insult, I'm just talking bullshit right now. Sometimes I wonder if I'm actually entertaining because all I do is talk nonsense. <laughs> I'm weird, but I'm okay with that. I accepted my weirdness longer. Mm. Yes, that's better. That's better for others. But I am. <laughs> I'm a good background sound. <laughs> when you get lonely, just turn on my streams and you will have weird sounds in the background and your neighbors will get scared of you. <laughs> Imagine having me as a neighbor. You would just constantly have some crazy bitch screaming at their cat like Meow! <laughs> Man. I'm weird. And I don't give a shit. <laughs> I have... I would like to say I am flavorful <laughs> with sparkles. <laughs> My neighbors have that already. I mean, is it a bad or a good shouting? I just answer her all the time when she meows at me because she's so fucking cute. Weeble is the cutest baby. I love her so fucking much. She is cute and so round and fluffy too. You look like a frog. <laughs> you look like a frog. Rabbit. Fuck, fuck. My sister is back. Back again. It's looking into your soul. Be afraid. Fear the frog. Me shouting at people and games, you can guess. <laughs> I would be more concerned by all the animals. Come on. If I were to live on my own, there would be just 50 cats or something. <laughs> Aye. Not concerning at all. As they would all be sprayed. Because I'm a good girl, I spray my pets. And the strays I can spray as well. It's not centered. Animals the mouth. Map 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 Turn the heat off. Shh. Also, why frog mouth? Uh, cause, cause cute. <laughs> it is so cute. Fuck. I don't like the hair. The way I do it. The voice rangeless has when it comes to saying make this ridiculous. <laughs> yes. She likes my demon voice the most. Maple. Baby, there is in this world. 
she actually hears when I'm angry with her, I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> and she's like, what the fuck? Mom's speaking to me. The demon has awoken. Now, my children, dance. <laughs> I. Yeah, I don't know. I like to make weird voices. I think it's funny. It's entertaining to myself. And um, my mother likes to call me weird. Uh, <laughs> don't know what people do. I don't care. I think it's fun. <laughs> like I don't know. I just I just randomly make sounds. of a sister lemon has arrived in the room she slammed the door and eats her sweaty ass on my bed you draw me like one of your french grills what are you doing to my cat don't eat her like that she's a baby don't eat the baby <laughs> okay twenty dollars for maple emote seems fair maple is best cat there's a maple emote. The issue is I don't have any emote slots uh, left for free stuff. Which is why currently the maple emote is only for money. Sadly. <laughs> That's the issue with like having uh, only a certain amount of slots available. Which depend on the sub count and all that stuff. Man, why am I so bad at drawing straight hair? I haven't. I, I always draw like fluffy and fat hair. I never draw straight hair. <laughs> the lemon demon. Exactly, she has arrived. What is wrong with me? This is the wrong restaurant. This is the right restaurant. <laughs> People who get the meme. You good folks. <laughs> Say I have no bitches. What way are you? I don't see them! <laughs> I only have smart boys in the chat, I don't have bitches. <laughs> and the only bitch I have is my sister. Heh, heh, heh. Chaz? Chaz is my mod. More than a friend of mine for a few years now. Yes, bitch. Hey, <laughs> did we have a cameo from Grumpy Sons and Lemon? And I wasn't here. She's in the background, um, sweating my bed after she just came home in her dirty clothes. Oh my god, you're so fucking disgusting! How dare you? Piece of shit. Even Maple is disgusted by your presence. She's licking her beans clean after you touched her. Sweet home, Alabama. Little, 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 little. Meow. You're so sweaty, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna sleep in your sweat tonight. <laughs> Disgusting. You could make a song out of it. Sounds like a fucking song title. <laughs> I gotta sleep in your sweat tonight. <laughs> and then 
I gonna see the street light. Hit the brakes. Cause you can see. Give you your glasses. And yell wee wee. <laughs> Sweaty. It's disgusting. <laughs> Cannibalism is good. What you stabbed a lemon today? Why did you stab a lemon? What the fuck is wrong with you? You suck. You sicko. <laughs> You're producing lemon juice. Yeah, you go. You go sell some jars full of lemon juice. People will buy it from you, man. Be a successful streamer. And just be like, hey, I'm selling lemon juice. People can figure out what kind of juice you're talking about or not. Could be anything. Because it's lemon juice. <laughs> Why does she look so high? Hi. All the time. Your head is way too small. Ow, ow, ow. Too much energy to come back. Game a girl. <laughs> when will Lemon start sc screaming? Screaming. Great question. Once she got her PC, maybe one sometime later. Maybe. Oh fuck! What the hell? Ah! Maybe she doesn't want to start alone and only starts at my channel or has me over on hers. I don't fucking know. Love her to her, honestly. I don't know what she'll do. She has to tell you on herself, man. She's a bitch, and I hate trying to leave. But can I hit the button? God damn it! I'm just stupid hit buttons. Meow, <laughs> meow. Hurdur. I'm. Maybe I change frog mouth to a uh, less frog mouth. Oops. You look dead inside. Why is that? Yes, I am. Mm, yes, baby. The mouth is way too. F <laughs> yes. Why can't I draw a mouth right now? What's wrong with me? I'm just going to, to, to change the position of this. Don't, 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 don't judge me. Yeah. Don't, don't, don't judge <laughs> Ah! Fuck, I thought I merged them. God damn it, man. Merge. There we go. Less frog mouth, more smile mouth. <laughs> lemon when the lemon step. What we want, lemon? The lemon will stream lemonade. Mabel, sh 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 Same as the croissant master. Hey, I also stream other stuff, just not at the moment. She will stream a lot more art, probably. Because she's more creative than I am. I, I'm, a, I'm, a, I'm a fucking wasteland when it comes to creativity. <laughs> you know what's the worst part about art streams? Picking out the music, because you have to consider the fucking copyright stuff. And that you can get banned and stuff if you use certain music. <laughs> <gasps> oh no, I gotta hurry up! Orange, purple, food is ready. We have to run. <laughs> Mabel, stop screaming, baby. You are very cute, but I don't like when you scream. Mabel, don't scratch the door. Stop it. No! I'm not ready yet. Aha, aha! Roll the colors 
in here, man. What am I doing with my fucking life here? Mabel, stop. Mabel. Stop it. Stop. She wants a whooper plush. Da -da 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 -da. Da -da. What? Lemma is kind of cute. That your sister is your inspiration. I'm not her inspiration. Why would I be her inspiration? What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> Can't think of anything else right now. Meow! Meow! I'm just an old fart. That's all I am. No. I don't know if she would have started streaming without a model, but I made her one. We could have just used a PNG as well, so I don't know. It's just an opportunity, you know, having a sister who, who makes that stuff for you or something like that, I guess. I don't know. Opportunity taken. Maple, shh. You have to wait. We're almost done here, okay? Shh. You can't do this, girl. Kitty cat. Did you just assume my gender? How dare you? Well, what the fuck? It's not white. That was lime green or something. What? What's going on? Why is she oring about? <coughs> we have to run, you little bitch. And Damn it, it's so fucking hot in here and I'm dying. There we go. That's all I managed to do today, guys. Oh, spamming the chat. I can't read that fast while I'm drawing, man. <laughs> ah, wait, where is my. Where is my. There it is. That's the wrong one. Twitch. I need my Twitch. Fuck. Ah, fuck. Get over here! Why don't you? Okay, hey, wait. I'm, 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 I'm fine. This is fine. I'm fine. <laughs> Let me check someone. Copium. <laughs> what? with your friends what is this I don't think I rated this person before so it's always nice to rate new people anyways it's been a while since I've streamed I will stream again later this week uh, I will probably spend tomorrow cleaning my little sister sorry for the noise ah I will be back with Pokemon Mystery Dungeon on Friday and Saturday I get motion sick with Stray. <laughs> uh, uh, yes, thank you all for being here today and my sister just yeeted the ring I bought her on the floor. <laughs> Very specific. I, I, I thank you all for being here today. We will see each other on Friday again if you're here and let's go raid and I have to fuck off or I gonna have my neck snapped or something. <laughs> Hope you have a nice rest of the evening. Glad to see you guys around. What the fuck are you doing? I I. 
No. Okay. Bye-bye! Let's go. Ready, ready.